we were up at the crack of dawn going for a walk but you wouldn't know it now so when get over here get over here oops I left the gate open anyways we're gonna go and start what we're doing Shovel head eight. Oh, get, get over here. All right, shovel head eight. Uh, welcome to a, another yard sale find. Uh, Sunday morning, and actually yard sale was Sunday morning. I really didn't expect any much more this year. So, but uh, I saw a sign, so I had to go. Got my two little buddies with me. We were all out walking at 6.30 this morning or quarter to 7, so. Anyway, so we're going to get going. I've got my, I must apologize for my appearance. I've got my Timmy clothes on. Timmy chews holes in, in my stuff, so. That's why I look so so ragged. So anyways, we started off with a top quality set of, of pruning shears with a sharpener oiler and everything so five bucks I paid mostly the, pr the prices they wanted for them because the prices were so cheap we got a there's a space plug if, if you got if you got a plug behind a couch or something you can use this to flatten everything out not good for everything but good for some things and here is a little set of scriber and magnet and inspection mirror and ruler and stuff so and uh, a couple magnets so anyways for for two bucks I can take it and we bought some books so ducks at a distance I can remember having this as a kid so flying ducks I don't hunt anyways but they're they're uh, nice nature pictures and this I didn't even bother looking inside it's an old outdoors book on canoeing the inscription that you can't read because it's all faded is 1945 so line drawings and everything like a nice collector book in nice nice condition and I saw this one and I immediately thought of bones at bones yard so there it is bones and of course there's probably another few seven boys too well, let's see what else is next assortment of little nuts and bolts not a great deal but not bad it's ten dollars I need to get some stove bolts but these are not the right size anyways but they'll still be good and then a box of treasures for two dollars so, treasures are always what you make of them so I got more than my money's worth in this one so a package of, of paint brushes a battery for some sort of phone that I don't have a magnetic door latch a piston ring tool turn button morettes fuse holder Huh. little light bulbs for for night lights snap ring assortment spotty screws for a car more turn buckles turn buttons this looks like an adapter for a European plug so I don't if I'll ever use that box of 15 black pens a 
tire gauge, key ring, or turn buttons. Plastic leg tips for furniture. A picture hanging kit. Put a little night light. Put a photo eye on it. What are these? Two eyeglass repair kits. I don't know why. A nice little change purse. Or a whatever headphones, whatever they probably had in it. Ah, a loony, loony bin. The Canadians will understand this. It's a, it's a change purse. Uh, loony is a one dollar coin in Canada. Nice pair of German made tweezers for mechanic work stuff. Nice small screwdriver. A couple more. Another picture of onion cut. A corkscrew with a golf ball on it. Uh, a little stereo extension cord, it looks like. Another screwdriver. A an illuminated vanity mirror for in your car I guess so and a, ended off a faucet seat wrench which I didn't have so that's the end of that two dollar box I think I did okay And then we go into another two dollar box and right there to start with is a washer and seal kit for, your, for taps and stuff so that paid the two dollars right there not sure what these are but I got two of them uh, some golf tees I can get rid of them Well, let's take a look. A tub of plumber's grease. A badly used faucet stem, but it's still brass. And a Volkswagen. So, another not bad two dollar box. Okay, so now we'll get back to the, the bigger stuff. I bought a toolbox. I was hoping it was smaller than one I had downstairs, but uh, it's actually bigger. So, that wasn't a good idea, but it was cheaper than brand new. And this, which is a patio heater that runs on one pound bottles. Or and I have an adapter for it as well. And uh, I managed to pick up a bunch of the bottles a couple weeks ago. So I'm all set. I just have to try it to see if it works. So anyways, that's about it. The dogs are out here causing trouble and uh, I'm gonna let you go and I'll upload this and uh, everybody enjoy their day and I'll hopefully there'll be another one next week so see you later